the legacy of of CanCon rules and factor, mm -hmm. people are going to look back. All those people who said we shouldn't be subsidizing art, you shouldn't subsidize music. Oh, they're making us play all this crappy Canadian music on the radio. Look at our scene. We have the three biggest pop stars in the world. Yeah. We have the three biggest indie bands, you know, like at least two of the three biggest indie bands in the world, New Pornos and Arcade Fire. Mm -hmm. There's Metric, there's us, and then there's F there's Grimes, mm -hmm. there's Junior Boys, there's Tim Hecker. In every single area of music, we have superstar, amazing, life-changing musicians. Mm -hmm. We have incredible hip-hop. I mean, it goes on and on and on. And that is because people starting out were able to apply for a grant and get some support and not have to work 14 hours a day at McDonald's and not have to give up. And, you know, I'm so glad that Stephen Harper is not prime minister anymore. And I'm really hopeful that the liberal government is going to double down and reinvest in art. They've said they will, and I believe them. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think it's going to pay off. I think there's going to be big dividends from that.